Police say what looks like a normal home in Virginia Beach hit a dangerous secret. Thanks for joining us. I'm David Allen. I'm Janet Roach. Police tell us they found things used for a drug lab in that home, all less than a half mile from town center. The man accused tells 13 News Now reporter Stephen Graves that it's all a big misunderstanding. Abraham Haynes says he's not angry, but just upset about how he ended up here. I feel very lost. Now behind bars at the Virginia Beach jail after first responders swarmed his home yesterday, neighbors on Tillman Drive took pictures as officers executed a search warrant. Police say it was all a part of an ongoing drug investigation out of Norfolk. What was told to me was that the person who was there to arrest me got a call from to see he works for CPS. He got a call saying I was making meth in the house. That house is now condemned. His wife and daughter stripped away after police charged him with possession of marijuana, also with making and distributing a controlled substance. Haynes admits to having drugs in the home, but never meth and making narcotics also never happened. All the glassware, the chemistry equipment I had, yes, was for essential oils and making soap. He says he sells the oils, soaps, and candles online as a side income. Currently, I was trying to extract the pigment out of the natural dye that I had bought offline. Haynes says the chemicals he used were harmless. If you look at my internet and everything I look at, you'll see what I'm researching. The 27 year old is now being held without bond back in court in July when prosecutors are expected to present more evidence. He says he's speaking to us because he's desperate. And I wish someone would just listen and see that <laughs> not everyone that has something that you don't like is illegal. In Virginia Beach, Stephen Graves, 13 News Now.